They are presumed to be planets that never quite made it, owing to the unsettling gravitational pull of Jupiter, which kept and keeps them from coalescing. When asteroids were first detected in the 1800s, the very first was discovered on the first day of the century by a Sicilian named Giuseppe Piazzi, they were thought to be planets, and the first two were named Ceres and Pallas. It took some inspired deductions by the astronomer William Herschel to work out that they were nowhere near planet size, but much smaller. He called them asteroids, Latin for star-like, which was slightly unfortunate, but they are not like stars at all. Sometimes now they are more accurately called planetoids. Finding asteroids became a popular activity in the 1800s, and by the end of the century about a thousand were known. And the problem was that no one was systematically recording them. By the early 1900s, it had often become impossible to know whether an asteroid that popped into view was new, or simply one that had been noted earlier and then lost track of. By this time, too, astrophysics had moved on so much that few astronomers wanted to devote their life to anything as mundane as rocky planetoids. Only a few astronomers, notably Gerard Kuiper, the Dutch-born astronomer for whom the Kuiper Belt of Comets is named, took any interest in the solar system at all. Thanks to his work at the McDonald Observatory in Texas, followed later by work done by others at the Minor Planet Center in Cincinnati and the Space Watch Project in Arizona, a long line of lost asteroids was gradually whittled down until by the close of the 20th century, only one known asteroid was unaccounted for, an object called 719 Albert. Last seen in October 1911, it was finally tracked down in 2000 after being missing for 89 years. So, from the point of view of asteroid research, the 20th century was essentially just a long exercise in bookkeeping. It is really only in the last few years that astronomers have begun to count and keep an eye on the rest of the asteroid community. As of July 2000,